I'm sorry that I didn't tell you guys earlier, but um, today and this weekend I will be in Columbus, Ohio. I'm going to be up there for the Secular Student Alliance Conference. Um, we're going to learn about things like how to start a group, how to keep a group going, how to keep people interested, that kind of stuff. So um, I'm going to be in Columbus all weekend. Unfortunately, my, my portable video camera is still packed up somewhere. I have no idea where it is. So I probably won't be getting anything from the conference. I apologize for that. Um, yep, that's pretty much... That's all I wanted to say. For those of you who are coming to Columbus, to the SSA conference, feel free to say hi because I don't really know anybody. I know a handful of people, but I don't really know a lot of people. And Yeah, so feel free to say hi. Um, pretty much it. Um, hmm. I want to make this video longer. I feel like I should give you guys something substantial. Oh, okay. Um, I have a question for you guys. So I'm taking this online stress management class and the whole reason I enrolled in it is because I needed just a boost in my GPA and it sounded pretty easy. But then the more that I'm reading about stress and stress related illnesses and things like that is really starting to scare the shit out of me. If any of you subscribe to Wired magazine, there's a there's an article in there about a guy trying to develop a stress vaccine, which is interesting. But anyway, so the more I'm reading about stress, the more I realize that I'm probably going to die from it because I am a horribly stressed out person and I don't do any stress relieving techniques whatsoever. Um, just today I started doing yoga. Just today I started doing it. See, the thing with stress relief is um, I can't meditate because it's boring as hell and I can't do anything where I just have to sit. So that's why I picked yoga is because um, I get to you know, pay attention to my breathing, pay attention to what muscles are stretching, count, my mind is being active and at the same time I'm you know, relaxing and stretching, that kind of thing. But I wanted to know what your guys' um, opinions are on atheism and yoga. Because, as you probably know, yoga is relatively overtaken with woo and pseudoscience. And I'm looking for videos on YouTube, you know, like little instructional videos. And most of the stuff I'm getting is talking about energy and chi and releasing the chakras. And, like, I just want them to shut the fuck up and teach me how to not want to kill someone in my daily life. So let me know what you guys think about the whole subject and maybe if you have different um, suggestions for stress relieving techniques where you, you're not just sitting. Um, I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna try doing puzzles more because you know your mind is active and you're trying to put things together but it's not over stressful. So I'm gonna try that. Any suggestions would be welcome because I'm new to this. And um, I don't want to die from some weird heart disease when I'm 30. That's it. I will make a video when I come back from the SSA conference.